So here is the Mary River crossing, adjacent to the railway, the Mighty Mary. Highway down Queen Street heading to Ganalda. Nice if you find somewhere here to have a bite to eat as well. Oh, there's a bakery. Don't think they're over now. Jenkins Road. And we're about to hit some burn. Well, gravel trail that is. So let's see how we go. Ooh, it's slippery. Nothing the DR can't handle that. The DR can handle it, but the rider can't handle it. <laughs> so there we go. Beautiful farmland out here. And uh, nice and quiet away from everyone. Not too far away from town too. But it looks as if um, I had a sign there saying it was the end of the, the Gympie Council maintained roads. So I'm thinking this may be part of the Bicentennial track. But we'll go down here a little bit. I don't think this is private property. I think it's still gazetted roads. That's what it looks like on the GPS. But we'll go down here. It's lovely countryside. Nice farming countryside here. Beautiful green hills over there. And of course we've got the, the cows. For those of you who don't know, we have a little hobby farm out west and we've got two cows. Lily and Honey. I'm expecting this is private property here. It doesn't really go much more. Well, where do we go? The trail's kind of... No, it's still a little bit of a trail here. But this could very well be private property. And I dare say, knowing the farmers around here, they're not very keen on motorbikes riding through their property. Uh, let's just have a look. So here is the Mary River crossing, adjacent to the railway, the Mighty Mary. difficulties finding it but I think we're on it there now working our way to Kilkiven. Nice little bit of uh, rugged track here this will be a good test. So Nat and I are still debating whether we get another bike for her and we take two bikes out on our next decent sized trip or the three of us Baxter included of course just handle it on the DR. So far so good. Um, okay, it might be a little slower. But, you know what? That's just part of the journey. 
was quite a quite a nice change actually instead of ripping through the bush just doing a, a reasonable pace there plan our days ahead just take it easy so far I think that should be fine We had quite a lot of rain recently, it doesn't take much for this car to become very dusty if you have another vehicle in front of you. Have a look at this review. It's beautiful. I wouldn't go swimming in there, but it looks lovely, doesn't it? You could camp there. Yeah. I can smell fires. Look at this cool little area. I'm sure there'd be mozzies here though. Which is nice to go through, take it nice and easy. Oh, it looks like we've got more fires up front. The smell of burning timber. Awesome smell. Here we are at the Kilkiven Hotel Motel. We're stopping here for some lunch. The three of us. <laughs> I'm not sure where the puppy dogs are allowed in there, but we'll give it a go anyway. <laughs> ah, there he goes. Our main mascot. <laughs> okay, so here we are. Look, 67% on the back. Here we are at Kilkiven Pub, having us a nice lunch. Uh, after a bit of a dusty trail, the camera's all dirty and dusty, which is good. That's a sign of a good, a good ride. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so we've, uh, I've ordered the chicken schnitzel. I think. Did I? You always forget, yes, yeah. you ordered the chicken schnitzel. And you ordered the pork chops. Correct. <laughs> and so we'll give you guys a look when we uh, when they come out. I'm sure they'll be fantastic. Oh yeah. 
here is our lunch. Oh, I got chicken sizzle and veggies and pork chops and veggies. Mm. Let's have a taste, though. Eh? All I can say that mine's very nice. Oh, you've already tasted <laughs> it. You cheated. That was so great. I wonder what sauce. I will ask the barmaid to surprise me with the type of sauce. Mm. Very good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Well, we're going to finish this and get back to it. You don't want to watch us <laughs> G'day again, guys. So we've just had a fantastic lunch at the Kilkiven pub. Uh, it's around 1.30 or thereabouts. And considering tomorrow is going to be a public holiday and all the shops will be closed, uh, Nat and I have decided to head back home and do some grocery shopping. Be an Easter Sunday tomorrow. So, um, thanks for watching. And if you like this video, don't forget to like and uh, subscribe below. We'll uh, see you in the next one. Bye.